Veronica wipes the face of Jesus. We adore your Christ and we praise you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. As the crowds were appalled upon seeing him, so disfigured did he look that he seemed no longer human. So will the crowds be astonished at him and keen stand speechless before him. For they shall see something never told and witness something never heard before. Who could believe what we have heard and to whom has the power of Yahweh been revealed? Like a sapling, he grew up in front of us, like a root in arid ground, without beauty, without majesty. We saw him. No looks to attract our eyes, a thing despised and rejected by men. A man of sorrows, and familiar with suffering, a man to make people hide their faces. He was despised, and we took no account of him. And yet, ours were the sufferings he bore, ours the sorrows he carried. But we, we thought of him as someone punished, struck by God, and brought low. Yet he was pierced through for our faults, crushed for our sins. On him lies a punishment that brings us peace, and through his wounds we are healed. I love you, Jesus, my love above all things. I am sorry with all my heart for having offended you. Grant that I may love you always. Then do with me what you will. I was thirsty and you gave me a drink. And the keen will answer, I tell you solemnly, in so far as you did this to one of the least of these brothers of mine, you did it to me. Lord, make me an instrument of your peace. Where there is hatred, let me sow love. Where there is injury, let me sow pardon. Where there is discord, let me sow union. Where there is error, let me sow truth. Where there is doubt, let me sow faith. Where there is despair, let me sow hope. Where there is darkness, let me sow light. Where there is sadness, let me sow joy. O Divine Master, grant that I may not so much seek to be consoled as to console, to be understood as to understand, to be loved as to love. For it is in giving that we receive, it is in pardoning that we are pardoned, and that it is in dying that we are born to eternal life. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. <laughs>